What's up guys? What's up guys? Welcome back to our channel and thank you for watching again. In today's video we're going to talk about what is Amazon FBA. So what is Amazon FBA? Some people think it's like drop shipping of retail arbitrage, mm. but it is actually private labeling. So what you do, you search for a product and you make your own brand on it. So you stamp your own logo and you make it your own. And that's why it's called private labeling. You label it with your own brand. And that's what you're going to sell on Amazon. So guys, how does this actually work? First of all, you start with a product research. There are a lot of tools out on the internet to do product research, but we personally use Jungle Scout. With Jungle Scout, you can just search on a product keyword and you will see what other sales are, the daily sales, the monthly sales, how many reviews they have, and a lot of more information. And based on the facts of Jungle Scout, you can actually see if this can be a good market to get into with another private label product. So the next step is to search for a manufacturer. After you found a good product, you will go onto, for example, Alibaba or DHgate, and you will search for a good manufacturer, send out 20 or 30 emails to manufacturers and see what manufacturer can provide you the, the wish that you have for your private labeling product. And the next step is creating your product. So you're going to make a nice logo, you're going to put your products in a set or you're going to differentiate yourself or whatever and the manufacturer will go starting the process and after they produce products they will ship this to Amazon. So your stock will be at Amazon. You will not have any stock at your house. You don't have to send anything because it's the fulfillment by Amazon program, Amazon FBA. So they will have your stock, they will pick pack and ship your products and the only thing you need to do is actually collect the money that you will get from selling your products. So let's talk about the pros of Amazon FBA. Like you don't need your own website, you use the website from Amazon to list your products on. So that's really great. Another great thing is Amazon is getting a lot of traffic already and all the traffic what's coming to Amazon's website is a potential customer for you, for your product. So that makes it amazing. Something else that it is really low risk. When you have your inventory and maybe it, it isn't selling that well and you think, okay, fuck, my product is not selling, now I lost all my money, what I put in all those products. But you can get your products back and just sell it through another channel. And that way you're never going to lose your money, you're going to invest. So it's a really safe way to start an online business. And not only to start, because that's another really big pro of Amazon FBA is that you can expand like crazy. When one product you sell is doing really well, you can add a second, a third, a fourth, a fifth. You can add products as you want, like as many as you want, because Amazon wants you to sell. Because then they make money and you make money and it's just amazing how many good opportunities there are. And I think the biggest pro is that you don't have your own inventory at your house or in your own warehouse. No, Amazon has all your inventory and they handle everything for you. So you only have to optimize your listing, make some pictures and enjoy the money coming in. And what's the biggest pro? You'll be able to travel as well while you're making your money on Amazon as we're doing at the moment working from Bali. Yeah, that's true. But there are also some small cons First of all, it takes some time to start off your own Amazon business. I mean, first you have to do your good research, you have to do your product research, search for your manufacturer, then it will take some lead time to get your products manufactured, and then you have to ship it as well. So we would say you will be able to get your products into Amazon within two months, but we would actually rather recommend to think about between the two and the three months. As well, a little con is it does cost money upfront, but as Timo already said before, there are so much possibilities if your product's not selling, what will be not likely to happen, then you have other opportunities to sell your products on other platforms. So for us, it's really a safe way to start off your business. Yes, I think it's one of the best business models of this time. 
you can start so easily with selling and you can expand your business to an all other level. Yeah, it's just amazing how this works. So guys, if you have any questions about Amazon FBA or you do want to start your own FBA business, just put it down in the comments and we are happy to help you with starting your own business. And we'll see you in our next video. Thank you for watching, guys.